looks like a Chinese Jiangwei class cruiser with a North Korean destroyer escort. Events in the Yellow Sea took a turn for the worse today when North Korean and Chinese forces blockaded and boarded a Japanese cargo ship. The North Korean government released no official statement, and their ambassador remained out of contact. While at the UN, Chinese Ambassador Long Dan urged the US and her longtime Japanese allies to remain calm, calling the blockades a legitimate response to what the rest of Asia views as a possible remilitarization of Japan. This blockade is an act of war. The NSC is working on a formal response, and they've ordered the USS Walsh to close at flank speed. The Walsh is the most advanced spy ship in history. My best man will be on board. What do you know? Chinese and North Korean ships working together again. It's what we expected. That's a 056 prototype, Chinese. Exactly. How are your sea legs? I haven't lost them. Good. Because the 056 prototype isn't the only new fish in the pond. Admiral Toshiro Otomo, head of Japan's newly formed Information Self-Defense Force, had this to say. This is another distressing attempt by China and North Korea to further depress our faltering economy. The ISDF and Japan appeal to our allies for the military support promised us under the post-war constitution of 1946. The fact remains that in the eyes of many in Asia, the ISDF itself is a violation of the post-war constitution prohibiting Japan from maintaining a military force capable of striking beyond its borders. In Asia, the memories of Imperial Japan are still fresh. What's up, everybody? It's your boy, Julio, coming back at you with another Splinter Cell. We are on to our third iteration of Splinter Cell, Splinter Cell Chaos Theory. Um, we're continuing our journey as Sam Fisher. You know I gotta bring my boy, uh, what's his name? Irene? Uh, what was it? <laughs> Lam oh, Lambert, Lambert, yeah. I don't know why I had a brain fart there. But yeah, we're moving on. Looks like we got a mission in Peru. All right, we're going outside the U.S. territory. I mean, we stay outside the U.S. territory. What am I talking about? Um, yeah, if I guess this game, like I said, it's going to be the third iteration. We're still with the NSA, the third echelon. Um, we're going to see what's going on. It looks like we're having a Chinese war or something. But, yeah, moving into the Punta Blanco light, uh, lighthouse outside Tal Tarara, Peru. Bruce Mana has been kidnapped by a Peruvian specialist group known as the People's Voice. Monhot's knowledge of dangerous computer algorithms must must not fall into the hands of the People's Voice of their leader, Hugo Lacaredo, Lacareda. That's crazy. But yeah, we're back on PC as well. So we're going to see how we play and out. Uh, let's get it going. Fisher, an American engineer named Bruce Morgan Holt has been kidnapped Morgan by Holt. a Peruvian separatist group called the People's Voice. Their suspected leader, Hugo Lacerda, is a mm. hardcore revolutionary preaching information warfare as the only realistic means to achieve revolution in modern society. We need you to get in there and recover or destroy any information Morgan Holt may have been forced to divulge, and if possible, rescue him. As for Lacerda, he's just been bumped onto our target of opportunity list. 
So if you have a shot, take it. Oh, you know I'm going to take rescue it. rescue isn't normally our bag, but Morgan yeah. Holt was part of Project Watson, mm. the UN committee that studied Philip Mass's handiwork after Georgia. Some people are worried that this kidnapping is just a cover-up, and that Could Morgan be. Holt is being interrogated for classified information about the Mass colonels. Fact is that some of the tricks Mass came up with could be used to do a lot of damage. We need to contain that information at all costs. At all costs. The target area is a lighthouse attached uh -huh. to an abandoned Spanish colonial era fortification and some nearby structures. We don't have an exact location on Morganholt, of course. so you'll have to find him yourself. <laughs> Insertion will be at night by Zodiac onto the beach beneath the fort. Thermal imaging shows that there are some old natural and semi-natural caves under the fort, so you may be able to use those for infiltration. Okay, we're going on to the beach. All right, Fisher. What the, the helicopter will drop you a few kilometers offshore in the Zodiac. You'll have one of my Zodiacs and logistical support in and out of the target area. Extraction will be by helicopter from the top of the lighthouse. Top of the lighthouse. This place international holds the contract with Wright Pritchard Technologies to protect their VIPs in potentially hostile situations. We did a thorough threat evaluation for their project in Peru, and we accepted the VIP detail on Morgan Holt. The guys who came after him knew what they were doing. Mm-hmm. This was not a tourist grab. I lost three good men in the snatch, and I'm currently preparing a rescue plan for approval from Morgan Holt's family and Wright Pritchard. This is going to cost this place a lot of money. That's pretty cool. I like how they incorporated different uh, different people here. We got, of course, Lambert, Anna, Grim's daughter, uh, William Redding. This is the new Captain Arthur Partridge and Douglas Shetland. I mean, he and I, I think I've seen him on the last game. But they also have a loadout here. Looks like we can do Redding's recommendation. Uh, recommendation. Uh, we can do stealth or assault. So I think this is where they incorporated different, you know, ways you could go into the the mission. We're going to do the recommendations, which I believe is stealth. I don't see no changes there. So, yeah. Uh, hey, here we go on the beach yet again, my guys. We're going to start off. Man, it's great to be back at Sam Fisher. Um, it's third iteration, you know, Chaos Theory. Still got Lambert on my side, man. Got some new uh, new tactics added to the game here. As you see, we're walking a little bit different as we enter this freaking Bat Cave. Man, I hope I see Batman. You know, Sam Fisher against Batman? No, that'd be crazy. Crazy. Whoa. Yeah, man, I love this series. I hear I'm some gunshots. Down there for yeah. Sure. Everything all right? It's coming from up ahead, but Lambert. When I think Gorilla, I think Kalashnikov. What do you mean? Mm. I've had enough AKs fired at me in my time to tell you that wasn't one. All right. See if there's anything unusual going on with their equipment. And keep us posted. There's some kind of old breach there. Huh? I'm gonna go this way. No way they heard me. I mean, I don't know if it has a suppressor or not. That was crazy. I was not expecting that. What in the world? I'm gonna try to grab him. I think you're right about the equipment, Sam. Yeah. What equipment? They got themselves a little stockpile of high-tech kit oh. here. Try and find out where they got it. <laughs> those crates have SSCC <laughs> barcodes on them and scan them with your EEV. Bro, look at this man's eyes, bro. What in the world? Nice piece. Where'd you get it? Oh, God. I don't know. I really don't know. You don't know? That's bad news for you, then. Ah, I tell you if I knew. I swear, please don't kill me. I think he's captain. Fine. If you don't know where the guns came from, then tell me something else that's useful. Ah, uh, ah, uh, Morgan Holt. Morgan, Morgan Holt. Holt. Oh, my God. You I'm looking for here him. For him. He's in the room just ahead. I think they're torturing him. Torturing him? Thanks for the info. Mm, no, no problem. I don't deserve to die. Okay. Yeah, but you see, we got a knife now when we interrogate people. 
pretty much uh, got new, you know, killing methods here. So that's why this game is rated M for mature. Can we pierce this? What's this gonna do? It's gonna take out the lights? Oh, yo, that's cool. I like that. I guess he wants us to scan the crate. The SSCC code is lot one of five. Oh. See if you can find the other four. I'll do my best. Gotta find four more. Say less. But yeah, man. It's been crazy. Uh, I have another video out. Oh. Let me see if I can shoot this. I have another video out about the new Splinter Cell game coming out. Man, that one's really popular by you guys. Uh, let me know if y'all want to see more informational videos. Cause I'll bring them to you. Get this good, this guy. Oh, what's up, buddy? How you doing? How you doing? I came out, came out of nowhere. Oh my gosh! Look at my face. I look crazy. <laughs> hey, take it right here. Never tell you that Spelunky <laughs> is dangerous. Oh no! You are going to kill me, right? I might. Only if you say the word monkey. Say monkey. Now tell me something I want to know. Uh. Ammunition and medical supplies. Check around inside the keep. They have tons of stuff in there. Some of you guys are real helpful. Why do you have to work for the bad guys? You're the American oppressor. You're the bad guy. Man, I'm not are the you bad guy. Say monkey? What? No. Then this conversation is over. Conversation's over here, man. Please don't. What the? <laughs> My boy, man. The faces they make on these old games, bro. That's so funny. Oh, this is another crate. Alright, looks like we got another one of these machines we can pierce. It leaks the oil out of it. Oh, okay, because they're like generators. Makes sense, makes sense. Whoa, is that my guy getting tortured? Alright, I don't know how that missed, but it did. Oh snap! Don't you think he's had enough? Open door he's still. Had enough when he can't talk. But Hello. Madre de Dios! He hasn't been able to speak for an hour. An hour. Would be faking it. Oh. Oh. Am I supposed to stop this? Jesus. See, I bet he's faking it. Faking it. His tongue is a lump of coal. His Ooh. brain is enough. Saul, give him more. It's already at the maximum. What? Dang. Should I bring down another battery? Another battery? <laughs> what do you say, amigo? You want another battery? <laughs> Wait a minute. His, uh, his ears. Uh oh. Look, small. He's dead. I think I'm going to be ill. I think he's dead. <laughs> Look at that guy, he's running. Only one way to be sure. Uh, I'm going for a walk. Oh my gosh. Oh, this guy's coming right at us. He's just gonna keep torching him? He's not even screaming no more. Oh god, our uh... No, we got our night vision, man. Got our thermal. This is new, the EVV. Oh, snap, hold up. Oh, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Please don't see me. Are you really going all the way up here for a broken light? Oh, can I grab you? Oh, oh, I just... He just did a split, and I just killed him. Not what I wanted. But gosh dang, look at this man. Jeez. I didn't even know you were capable of doing that. He must not have what I think he has, you know what I'm saying? Ain't no way I can do a split. I'll tell you that right now. Oh, it's my dog, man. It doesn't sound too good down there, Fisher. The sound isn't the problem. You should smell it. You're sure he's dead? Deader than Elvis. All right, leave the body. We still need to recover any traces of the interrogation. Grim will call you back. Uh, let me tell you this I guy. already don't like you. Don't make it worse for yourself. Who? Who are you? Don't worry Shut about up. that. Why did you torture Morgan Holt? Lacerda told us to. Why? What does he want to know? Math problems. Programmer stuff. I don't get it. 
You're just the stupid one who likes to hurt people, huh? Exactly. Yep, Can you think him. of a reason why the world wouldn't be a better place without you? Uh, please. I. I didn't think so. <laughs> I didn't think so. I'm still trying to figure out. I feel like the only way to kill them is by just sneaking up on them, and instead of like punching them, he like uses the knife and just cuts them. Slits their throat or something. Look at that. It can blow out the candle, man. Innovative. I'm oh, my boy. That's my target. I was supposed to cat. I was supposed to free. And they really got him. Man. Disrespectful. Fisher, cut him. I said leave the body. No. We don't have the means to extract him. Just because he's dead doesn't mean I need to leave him here hanging like a piece of meat. Don't get too connected, Fisher. I need you to stay rational. You can spare 30 seconds for some simple Bro. dignity. Sam, it's grim. We need to make sure that whatever Morgan Holt might have told them about Mass's algorithms never leaves this site. Whoa. Okay. I detected a wireless link coming from the technician who left the room before you entered. So I'll need to recover any data he might have uploaded to their servers. Exactly. From the looks of it, these gorillas have a pretty temporary setup. Seems unlikely they have oh. any kind of alarm system on location. Good. We can really cut the tent. I'm gonna grab him. Don't worry about me. I'm just gonna go back out. I think there's another guy here. Yeah, there he is. Let's interrogate this guy. You look important. I am loyal. Uh, loyal. Get no information from me. I'll really? see about that. Hmm, it looks like you forgot to shave this morning. That's Let a full beard, a my guy. Huh? You can't. Hey, no. what are you doing? Okay, okay. What do you want to know? I'm looking for Lacerda. He's been behaving very badly lately. Well, you're wasting your time, American. No such thing. He left in a boat an hour ago. He could be anywhere by now. I guess I'll just have to follow him then. I'm gonna find him. Don't worry. He won't slip away. I hope the water is warm. What? what? I think that confirms it, Fisher. Yeah, seems like Lacerda's long gone. We'll see if we can track him through Echelon. Don't worry about him for now. We'll keep you posted. Holy! What the hell was that? I just whistled. Hey man, really just came up behind him and did that execution style, boy. Look at the way the lights are swaying, bro. This this is going crazy. I feel like there's something. Oh yeah, there is something. Scan this. That's three out of five. Keep track for me. You know what I'm saying? I can't keep track for myself. That's too hard, man. Back in school, I had to use my fingers to count, man. Come on now. I'm trying to expose myself out here, but... Oh, hold up. Okay, okay. Looks like there's another crate here, but is there someone else? Too bad it's overcast. Why? They say that we are at the right latitude to see the debris re-entering the atmosphere. What? Debris? What are you talking about? Madre de Dios. You didn't hear? No. Nope. International Space Station. There's been an accident. They've lost radio contact and they've confirmed that there's major damage. They expect that the debris shower sometime this evening. In pride, the reason is right. Our error lies. All quit their sphere and rush into the skies. Him, the almighty power. Horn headlong and flaming from the ethereal sky, who doors defied the omnipotent to arms. Ay, ay, ay. And I thought I was a dilettante. <laughs> Education is the difference between a revolutionary and a terrorist. What are they talking about, my guy? Can you not see me? It's crazy. This guy's going that way. I'm gonna try to grab him. 
Oh, he goes that way. Nope. Didn't work out as I planned, but it's fine. Let's go. Drop them off. I'll just be jumping that bodies again, man. We gotta go over there and get that box. I wonder if this will attract him. Oh gosh, I think he seen me. It might have attracted him. The lights back on. Oh, he's coming back. He's coming over here. I don't know if it's like the other splinter cells when the lightning strikes, I get visible. I'm gonna try to come up behind him. Oh, I got you now, buddy. I got you now. You wanna come over to see your other buddy? He's gone. Dead. Deceased. You can go to sleep with him though. You know what I'm saying? You'll wake up in a few. Alright, cool, cool, cool. I think this is the other box here. That's four of the five crates, Sam. Oh. Keep your eyes peeled for the last one. Appreciate it, Lambert, for keeping track. Pop these lights real quick. Oh, this way. I wanna go this way. But yeah, let me know how y'all like the uh, Splinter Cell series and uh, what do you think I should improve on. Oh, it's the other thing. Oh. Oh, there's two people here. One's asleep. One's right here. I wonder if I should... Come here. Come here. Why you look so surprised, bro? It's okay. It's okay. You can go to sleep. There's a health kit or a med kit. Is there anything useful here? I don't think so. I don't think that's something I need to grab. Bro, my boy Sam. Oh, this is a vibe, bro. It's raining. Got a fire going with the music. Oh. On the catwalk here. I don't have no one, so we should be good to move forward. Oh, hold up. There's someone right here. Right in front of us. Come on, Julio. Be observant, man. I'm gonna grab him. You got any useful information, man? Hold up. Why did you torture Morgan Holt? La Celta. He wants algorithms. Algorithms. Some kind of computer algorithm. What does a second-rate communist revolutionary want with a computer algorithm? I don't know. I don't even think La Celta knows. I think <laughs> someone might have hired us. What makes you think that? I don't know. La Celta. He's been making lots of deals. Something's going on. I don't know what. But you don't know who he's been talking to. No. And you're not much good to me anymore. Oh. I told you everything. All right, cool. I appreciate that. Where's your loyalty lie? That's fine. I mean, your life matters more. Let's go here. That server is the one that the tech transferred the interrogation record to. You'll need to access it. <laughs> I just shot. I just popped the radio. Good work, Whee! Sam. That wiped whatever information Morgan Holt might have given them. Okay. Won't they wonder what happened to it? It was easy enough to make your little intrusion look like a memory allocation error. Don't worry. We give you the best tools. But I'm not going to read these. If you guys want to read those, you can uh, pause the video. Unless you want me to read them, but I don't really want to read them. Is there a crate here? No? Alright. I was looking for that fifth crate. Two guys. You look troubled. Thunderstorms make me nervous. Oh, I just got past. I just went past. I was a boy in Granada when the Arabs invaded me. There's the other one. The Good work, Fisher. We can analyze the intelligence you gathered from those crates. We can make a lot of people's jobs a whole lot safer. 
How come no one ever does things to make my job safer? If you want me to hire some more analysts to interpret information for you, I think you can manage. Second thought. The danger's not so bad. Uh, what you working on? Uh, oh God! Who are you? I'm already tired of that question. Why don't you just answer mine? Uh, I'm, uh, I'm trying to cut open this gate so I can get at the power cables inside. Why? The power feeding that main server in the southwest oh, yeah. tower isn't stable. What? We need to protect the data. Hmm. I got some bad news for you. I already took care of the data on your server. <laughs> oh no! Lacerda's going to kill me! I think you should be more worried about me than Lacerda. Yeah, I'm here right now, man. Don't let me suffer! I'm gonna knock you out. Still gonna be on you. Can't believe I got I sneaked past those two other two guys. Oh, that guy. I think he's coming down there to investigate. Alright, I'm out, I'm out, I'm out. Are we going to the lighthouse? I think that's what they want us to do. Oh yeah, we are. Had to shoot that light one time. Okay, there was like some rope here. Oh, object. Okay, okay. Oh, there's a guy right there. Can you see me here? Hope not. Want him to come over here. That way, I could do something like this. Okay. Not gonna work. I might have to pop him. I don't wanna do this, but I'm gonna have to. That's what I have to do. Evening star to Maria Narcisa. Come in. The Evening heck? star to Maria Narcisa. Come in. There he is. Hey, what's up, man? Who were you talking to? What? Who are you? I'm the guy who's going to break your knees if you don't tell me who you were talking <laughs> this to. This is so funny. Oh, God. You... It was La Cerda. Hugo La Cerda. Oh, La Cerda. He? It's aboard the ship. The Maria. Narcisa! Why? Weapons! He's delivering the new weapons to the other cells! If I find out you're lying, I will come back for you. Oh god! Oh please. gosh! <laughs> That's so funny, man. The, the threats he makes to these people is like the most hilarious. I'm gonna come back, man. Like. You know I'll come back too. You know I'll Maria kill you. Narcissa. You're not trying to set me up on another blind date, I hope. Oh, gosh. The Maria Narcissa is a boat. So was the last girl you set me up with. Fisher. The Sorry. <laughs> the Maria Narcissa is a cargo ship owned and operated by Celestinia Inc., a oh. Portuguese shipping company. Registered in the Philippines, cross-Pacific freight contracts. Lots of details missing. Sounds yeah. suspicious. Sounds like I'm setting you up for another date after all. Yeah, it does. Can't wait to meet her. Fisher, your primary objectives are complete. Extract you whenever you're ready. You'll need to signal for a helicopter pickup from the top of the lighthouse. Make sure the light is out first. Will do. Got you. I got you. So we're ready to get picked up. Oh, what up? The heck? Come on. No, not today, boy. I'm out. Yes, sir. Mission complete. Oh, I like this. Look at this. Objective review. Rescue Magahawk. Cancelled. He, he died due to torture. Cover and destroy. Cover. Discover. Ex extract. Uh, oh, scan the SC bar of delivery crates. That's an opportunity objective. Went ahead and did that. Did 90%. We knocked out nine people. Killed five. Did it in 21 minutes and 50, 21 minutes and 50 seconds. That's pretty good if you, I don't say so myself, but let's go ahead and get on to the next one.